viewers, thank you for joining us today on the Gerber Children's Wear channel, where we show you some very simple and affordable ways to take Gerber products and a few household items to create a very special gift to give to a new parent or to be the hit of any baby shower. Today, we're gonna show you how to make this Gerber Blanket Buddy. Now this is actually my favorite gift to show you how to make, so let's get started. The first thing that you're going to need to pick up from the store or order online is your Gerber two pack of very cute novelty caps and your four pack of Gerber flannel blankets. The next thing you're going to need are a few rubber bands, your favorite pair of scissors, tape, and some ribbon the color and width of your choice. The first thing you're going to do is make the legs. Take your first blanket and just lay it flat like so. Find the middle of your blanket. Take the outer edge and fold it to the middle. Make sure it's lined up at the edges. All right, then what you're going to do is take the middle edge and fold it about four inches past the line here. And then you're gonna take it once more and fold it just like an accordion or a fan and you're going, to, you're going to have two folds after you're done, okay? And you should be able to see the pattern on the top. Now you're going to do the same thing to the other side of the blanket. Take the end of your blanket, move it to the middle, smooth it out, bring the edge about mm, four inches past the natural fold here, and then bring the edge back to meet the other end of the fold and smooth it out. And again, you should have two folds right here. Now what we're going to do is take the edge of the blanket and roll it very tightly. When you get your legs rolled up, you wanna hold it, grab the tape, Take one little piece of tape, it doesn't need to be very long. Go ahead and secure your blanket roll with the tape. Go ahead and do the same thing with the other side. Set your legs aside. Grab another blanket because now we're going to make our arms. So we're gonna follow the same steps as before, but this time we're going to want our folds to be a little bit longer, so at the end, our roll is a little bit shorter because your arms are a little bit shorter than your legs. All right, so first you're gonna take the fold and fold it forward past the center of the blanket about four inches. Now you wanna take the fold and bring it back and bring it past the original fold that has been created here. And now you wanna fold it forward again, same as you did on the legs, and flatten it out. Now you should have two folds right here. Okay, the same as making a fan or an accordion. Now you wanna do the same thing to the other side. Now you're going to take one side of your blanket, just like you did the legs, you're gonna very tightly roll up the arms. This is so easy, and in no time we'll have our blanket buddy. Place a piece of tape over the folds of the blanket to hold them together. Perfect, and now you've got your arms. Go ahead and put it to the side. Now we're going to make the body. Take another blanket, you're gonna lay it flat. Now you're gonna fold it into eighths lengthwise. Go ahead and fold one edge to the other edge. Flatten it out. Now you're going to take one fold and fold it to the edge again. Now you've folded it into fourths, so you're just gonna fold it one more time to make eighths. All right, and set that to the side. Now you're going to take your last blanket, lay it flat. You're gonna take the outer edge and fold it to the middle. Take the other edge and fold it to the middle. All right, 
Now you're going to fold it one more time to the middle and to the middle. Now you're going to take your first blanket and lay it on top of your second blanket. Take the edges of the outer blanket and bring them in. Now you're going to secure it with one rubber band. Next, you're going to take your legs and place them directly in the middle of your blanket over the rubber band. Now it's getting exciting. Take the inner blanket and tightly roll it to meet the center line and put them right on top of the legs. And you might have to tug a little bit. And then you want to do the same thing to the other side. Grab the other blanket and roll it very tightly to the middle. And this time, you're actually going to put the top roll over the bottom roll, just like that. And this is going to be the body. Now you want to grab your arms and put them right here. Then you want to take the outer layers of the blanket and bring it up to the top. Hold it with your fist on top while you grab the other side of the blanket and pull it to the top. Now you can start to see the body forming and you want to secure the top with a rubber band. I like to double band the top. Now you have your blanket up here and you're going to want to fold it over to create the shape of a head. Now grab your cap. You should have two caps. One will be an animal and one will be a design. Go ahead and grab the cap that has the design. Now we're going to put the cap onto the head. Pull the cap all the way down, make sure it's very snug. Next, you can probably guess, we're going to grab the last cap and fit it over the Blanket Buddy head. Grab your ribbon and some scissors, and you want to measure how long it will be around your Blanket Buddy. And for me, that'll be about 12 inches. Get your scissors and go ahead and cut the ribbon. Lastly, you'll need to put the ribbon around your blanket buddy. And there you go. There is our super cute blanket buddy. And it didn't take very long to make and it didn't take too many materials. Every blanket buddy is just as unique and special as the baby that it's for. So today we've made this very cute cat, but there are also many different other blanket buddies that you can make. We have a duck, a cute little bear, a cute little frog, and a nice little monster here. So, and the monster is a great way to also give some booties to your new baby. You just put those on the ends of the legs and arms. So we had so much fun showing you how to make a blanket buddy. Join us next time. Thank you.